This is a weird one that I'm doing today. I saw in a Facebook um, group uh, for the carnivore diet, somebody said, how do you guys eat your eggshell membranes? Eggshell membranes? Mm-hmm. And- Do we eat them? No, right, but you know how like if you make a hard boiled egg and it's got that skin on there, or if you crack an egg, it's got the skin. Well, apparently that skin is collagen hmm. and it's like a special collagen. There's types that aren't necessarily, I don't know what it is, type V and five, I guess, Roman numerals and X. Um, anyway, so I was like, hmm, he said he, he was just cooking them and they were like chewing on tires or like really weird. And I was like, I have eaten that on a hard boiled egg before and I kind of like it. It's kind of fun when you get the skin on oh, there. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. But, so I was like, huh. So after I cooked those giblets, or not giblets, but the, um, what are gizzards? they The gizzards yesterday, I had that hot fried oil. So I had peeled out my chicken's membranes or my egg membranes, cause we eat a bunch in the morning. And I just threw them in there after, I dropped them in one by one. Oh. And they fried. And they were delicious. And Did I didn't I even any? give any to Steve <laughs> because it was so fast. I was like, oh, I don't think he's gonna go for this. Oh. But it, they were so weird and good that I'm gonna make them again today and you're gonna get That's to eat weird. them. Oh. I know, it's special. So it's like glucosamine, the equivalent or better apparently. And it's um, collagen. So it's very good for you. So if you guys are into the eggs and you're cracking them every day like we are, we're gonna have, I'm gonna make um, eight eggs this morning not, we're not gonna eat them all day. We're just gonna have two we're and two and then one of our coffee. Once. Yeah, but we stick a couple in the fridge for dinner. And so uh, right now is when I'm gonna have the eggshell membrane. So let me show you how I did it because it was really weird. So. I believe I didn't know about that. I know, it was down the hatch before you even got a chance to know about it. Never knew that, Yeah. Not eggs. Never knew what gizzards were, but I know what this is. Look at the size of his steak. That's my steak. Look at how what thick is that is. Hey, don't mess with the thermometer. All right, I gotta get this thick. going. I've got, oh, by the way, if you don't know what to do with all your bacon grease, I saved the bacon grease and I've got several of these jars and I haven't known what, known what to do with them. So right now with frying these chicken gizzards and um, frying these eggs, this is what I'm gonna do. So deep fry them. And I know that they are, it's the protective membrane. So the gross stuff, I guess, from the outside of the egg that can absorb, doesn't get into the actual egg, but we're frying it. So it's getting completely burned off. And bacon grease has like salt and stuff and it's delicious. So it flavors it and gives it kind of like a cool little thing. I guess apparently the shells are really good too. And you can buy powdered eggshell membrane. Like if you don't want to do this, but we might as well eat the one that we have if it's easy enough to get off. And they're not that hard to get off. So let me show you. Okay, eggs broken. You can see the little membrane. There's like a puddle back there, but usually what I did was I just grabbed part of the broken part and just gently peel it and it just comes off. And then I throw the shell off. The other ones I did yesterday came off easier than this. But, um, and then I just stuck them on a little plate, saved them to fry. So now that I'm doing this, I'm thinking about saving my shells because it's really good calcium. If we save our shells and then you cook them, you know, to where they're sanitized, you can powder them up and then eat those. These eggs are way harder to do than the ones I did yesterday. Costco eggs were better than these ones from Sprouts. Maybe not all of them. I'm sure Amanda's are gonna be amazing. She's got, um, you know, she raises her own chickens and those are gonna have a really good membrane, I bet. Easy to get to. And I don't mind leaving the white on there and everything because it's, if there's some stuck on there, because it's, we're cooking it and it's just egg white. Here they go. That one has a little shell on it. There they are. Really fast. Turn them around. It just looks like a fried egg, kind of. It's weird. But that's collagen. 
And special collagen, I guess. So we'll see what Steve thinks. Good salt on my guess, but I ate them yesterday without. Let me try one. Look, that's why the, it was like nothing. I don't know. They're good. Okay, we'll wait till Steve comes in. Let's give him a try. See, you'll see why. Is it too hot to touch with my hand? No. Or? It looks like a latex condom. <laughs> Yummy. Wow. It's good and very odd. It's almost like the edge of an egg when you cook it mm. and it gets a real thin, like um, a fried egg. And it just goes along the edge of the pan or something. If you would have gave me this and I didn't know it was egg, I wouldn't say it was an egg. Here, grab this whole little glob and you'll see it's kind of, this is what I did yesterday. I just shoved it all in my mouth and I did it right from the, right from the source. Labor it's intense, delicious. but they're very delicious. It's delicious. And it's free. Um, Cause we were throwing it in the trash. And unique texture thing going on. Yeah. That is wild. I know. They might even like hmm. be, that's really good. I guess it would just be a weird snack, but maybe you could just snack on them. I don't know. I mean, you'd have to make a bunch. I don't really have any idea. That's mine. Anyway, we got to eat breakfast. No, that is really, so, really good. Just an idea. If you want some more collagen in a pure source that you can totally eat and you're already going to have it anyway, there you go. That fun. is delicious. I know. And it's a fun snack. It is. Enjoy your life.